All right. So I have about 10 or 15 minutes. I downloaded the stupid hair color mod. I just want to see, one, that it doesn't break my game, and two, if I can use it um, to change some of the hair colors. Um, I'm kind of tired of using the same hair colors in the, in the game, um, so I thought it'd be fun to be able to do something different, especially with the elves. Um, tell you what, I will show you, I'll show you the mod if we can get this to work. Let's just do, let's start with the high elf I was fooling around with the other day. We'll just see if we can change her hair color and maybe her skin color and stuff. I'll use the cheat room and see if, I think this mod is compatible and I'll be able to see the different skin colors and stuff. So we're going to try it out. And then um, I'll show you the the mod I'm referring to, and I'll leave a link to it on uh, on YouTube. Assuming this this makes it there, it's, which it should. But sometimes sometimes things don't get saved on a mixer like I want them to. So um, and hopefully this will not be horrible um, quality. Uh, sometimes sometimes I think the reason things don't get saved is that my my stream quality isn't good enough. Um, so that could be a problem. Um, let's see, we're not sneaking, are we? Nope, we're not sneaking. Um, let's, let's set her up to teleport. And we're gonna go try this out real fast. If we don't like it, we don't lose anything. Let's just go to the cheat room. We can come right back. Shoot, I can totally just not even save anything if it's bad. Anyway, I mean, you notice her. Um, I called her Silvira. Or Sylphira. Eh, however you want to say it. You can say it however you want to. I like it anyway. Um, it's kind of a female version of the name Silvern, which I use a lot in WoW. And uh, I've used it in other games. Anyway, I've also used it in Oblivion. Um, oh, so here we go. I wanted to try. Let's see if we can... Um, let's see. Let's save her. Just, just wants to be safe. Let's save her the way she is before I do anything. That way if I mess something up, it's not too bad. Alright, so I don't want to mess with the presets really. However, skin tone is supposed to have a lot more versions of skin colors, which I am seeing a lot of different skin colors, which is cool. She's a high elf. Oh, it would be nice if I could make her I know, maybe not everybody's thing, but I don't know. I like blue. <laughs> anyway, let's keep looking. All these, oh, that's a nice dark purple. I like that. That's a good purple. Yeah, and it depends on what you like. That red is just about too much. Probably because of my um, saturation. I, I have my game, like, really heavily saturated. Well, I say heavily. Heavily for me. Now, other people might say, no, my game is way more saturated, and they could probably prove it and be right. Uh, that's fine. I don't have a problem with that. Okay, so I do get some different skin colors. So, okay. Let's just have some fun. I liked the blue. Well, I really liked the purple, too. That dark purple like that, that's nice. I about will have to change her eye color if I do that, though. I don't know why, but... I like that blue, too. I like the dark blue and the dark purple, but the purple might be... That seems just a little more satisfactory. And it's... I know, this is very subjective, so don't don't try to hold it against me or anything. Um, okay, I'm not going to change any of this, though supposedly it adds a lot more war paint and stuff, too, which I suppose we could play with that. Let's see if there's something different. Um... These all look the same to me. Maybe those are different. Those seem slightly different. What about the colors? They're supposed to be more war paint colors. There seems to be a lot of different colors here that weren't there before. Um, I don't usually do war paint. In this case, this is tint around her eyes also. Which, if I could find a good color... be acceptable, but some of these colors are a little too, um, 
right, I think is the right word. That green is okay, but with purple, I'm not really thrilled with it. Um, that's kind of, eh. Maybe I should wait and see what her hair color is going to be. Because I'm going to play with that, too. That's a... Is that more purple? That looks like more purple, doesn't it? It's a dark purple. It's not bad. If you wanted to have something. Does it show? Oh, it's there, too. You don't see it because of her hair there, but it's there. Hmm. I'm not offended by that. It's not overly bright. Some of them are too bright. They're not, uh, for lack of a better word, they're not realistic because they're too bright. that makes sense? Um, because on your skin, I mean like that, that's that's pretty realistic. Um, we can try that, just for fun. We'll give it a whirl, right? Okay, so let's try that. Um, I don't know if I'm going to mess with the eyes very much. I did want to make the colors different, though. I want the... Get your hand out of your face. I want the eye color. I wanted it to be something that would stand out. Oh, wow, I really don't get a lot of options on the eye colors, do I? Well, that may be... That may be the best, other than the farmer look, which I don't want to do. I think we're going to keep that. Let's just go with that for now. I'm going to leave her brows the same. I'm not going to change that. I'm going to change her mouth. Her hair... I don't think I have new hairstyles. I think it's just hair colors. So, let's see what we get. Let's just start at the beginning. That's a really bright blonde. That's a good blonde. Some are really too bright for me, and then some look pretty good. I want the hair to look still fairly realistic, uh, but I want it to have a good color. Something, and maybe something a bit fantasy-like, you know, something that you would not normally um, see in our everyday lives. Which, I, I thought this color was pretty good, which is similar. If it's not what I was using, it's very similar, but I think it's what I was using. That's, that's decent. Oh, now there is a red. Wow, okay. I don't know if that's part of the original... Ooh, that's, okay, that's too bright. Maybe that's due to my, ooh, that's too bright, too. Um, the blue, that's, um, a little, that's better. Um, whoa, that's too bright. That's pretty good. I think I like the other red a little, oh, I like the green, that's cool. Is that what, that's about the same color as her eyes. That's interesting. I might come back to that. I do a reverse Hulk. We'll have purple skin and green hair. Whereas he had green skin and purple pants. You know, type of thing, if you remember. Um, well, could give her purplish hair. Oh, that's, that's a cool color. See, this is the type of thing I was looking for. I was hoping to get some different color options just for fun. Um, yeah, it's not going to be realistic. It's going to be more, purely more fantasy. But that's a that's not a bad color there. I really like that one red, and that one red may be from the game. Maybe just from the game. It may not be anything new. But um, but somehow with her skin color, it really looked nice. So I don't care if it's one of these new colors or not. Oh, those are, those are pretty good colors. I think some of those are from the regular game, but some of these are not. Now that's a cool color there in its own way. It doesn't really suit what I'm doing in my mind. Yeah, see, I like that red. Somehow that red works well for her. Of course, the green is not bad, though I think I like the other green earlier better. But that's not a bad green. So this was all just to see if this mod was working. I should probably just hop... Oh, look at that. That would match her tattoo, that purple hair. Do you see that? That matches the uh, war paint, I mean, which I think of as a tattoo. But 
That's funny. It also matches her skin. It's probably too much purple. Don't you think? I mean, there is such a thing as too much, even though um, I like pur purple, especially dark purple. I think the green hair is kind of cool, so I'm torn between the green and the red. Why is that? Okay, let's go back. I like this green. This green isn't too bright. I like that. And what was that? There was a dark red back in the beginning. Though this one's not bad either. Hmm, I think I'm going to go with the green. Let's just go with it. And let's see what. Uh, you know, we'll give me a. Let me play around with this and we'll see how it goes. There's that green. Is there another green that was any better? There's another green in here. I saw it for a second. Oh, it's too bright. There's another green there. Is that too bright? Uh, it's a little bright for me. That's a little... And that's a little dirty looking. I want it to actually look green. Is that stupid? Maybe. Maybe. That's like Doc Samson green. That's not quite dark green. It's kind of a lighter green. Was there a good green here? There's that really... That was that initial red that I thought was cool. It is nice. I think I'm going to go with the green. I've sort of sold myself on it now. Alright, we're going to go all the way to the end. Just hold on. Going all the way to the end. And yes, everything is a reference to either food or comics or coffee or something. Because that's just... That's just me, man. That's just the way it is. So was this the green? Oh, it wasn't that one, too. Yeah, I think it was this last one. Which, that's nice, too. I may have to use that on somebody else, that color. But uh, I like this green. Let's go with this. I'll let her keep this. Um, yep, we're done. We're not changing her name. So now she's purple with green hair. And I did give her the little the little war paint, which I usually do not do. But um, I don't know. Let's take a look. I think it looks pretty good. Depends on what you like, of course. I don't have her wearing anything fancy. Very nice. Oh, and there's my alarm. Okay, I got time. I'm going to save this. And I'm going to show you the mod I'm referring to. Because it adds skin colors. And let's just save her. I, li I think I like her. We'll, we'll probably keep her the way she is. Um, oh, wait. I should just teleport back. Let's go back real fast. Here we go. This will be fine. Um, so save here. We'll just do another save since I made that change. Alright. So let me exit out. I think I have just enough time to show you um, the mod I'm referring to and then like I said when I post this to YouTube I'll uh, put a link. Um, simple. It was a simple mod. I was hoping that I had it in the right place and that it wouldn't break my game and stuff. Um, it's supposed to just be some skin colors and hair colors um, and war paint colors. So um, let me see if I can find it again. I don't remember the name to it. I just happened to find it while I was looking around. I thought, you know, it'd be interesting to have some more stuff. And there's other options. This is just the one that I chose for, well, whatever reason, right? Um, let me just look up hair colors real fast. That's how I found it. I'm sure it's in my list. I guess we could just look in my library. It's in my list here. We just have to find it. I'm not always the best at finding stuff in this list. I kind of wish it was alphabetized or something. And plus, sometimes it doesn't show everything that's in your library because it only shows so much. And if you have more than whatever that limit is, which might be about 100, I don't know. And I run with about 120 mods. See, it's not going to show it, and I didn't favor it. Okay, let's just roll down to the bottom down here. It's down close to the bottom in my character stuff. We're getting there. No, nope, we've got to go a little further. All right, it's this one. Skyrim Vanity Kit. That's it, okay. Skyrim Vanity Kit. This adds, you can tell here on the right-hand side if you look, and I'm pointing at the screen again like you can see me, but you can't. 
It's okay. Um, 50 hair colors, 19 makeup. Oh, it adds makeup colors. See, we could go in and mess with that, too. It adds more paint colors, skin colors. Um, oh, well, it tells you how many it adds. So, for the high elf, 19, 14 for the dark elf, and 17 for the orc. 10 scale colors for Argonians, eh, 8 fur colors for Khajiits, that might be interesting. 3 dirt colors, all races, I don't, I don't use dirt. Um, anyway though, but see all that, all that's pretty interesting and all that's under a mag. You can see it's 952.64 kilobots, um, so not bad. So um, this mod includes all 43 Skyrim hair colors, plus seven additional exclusive colors. It also works perfectly with Skyrim hair colors add-on. Um, oh, okay, so this is part... Oh, this is why, okay. Anyway, so this is a combination of a couple other mods that you can get if you just want the hair colors. I just decided I wanted the hair colors and a little bit of this other stuff to play around with. I'll play around with it more later. Uh, like I said, right now I have to go. Um, so, uh, for now, hey, just, uh, thanks for, thanks for watching, and have a good one.